all right um in this uh, video i'm gonna be showing you how to set up your autoresponder so the first thing you want to do you want to go to your play store and you want to download your autoresponder so you are going to go to your search bar and this is the search bar under there you type an uh, autoresponder for whatsapp so this is the one i want to use which is up there autoresponder.ai so i want to install it first on my phone so after installing you now open so you click on get started um possibly this one i'm going to be using will be showing you that um you have seven free seven days free so it all depends on the one you are using but the settings is almost the same you just follow the same process so click on get started so it's asking me i don't want to register i will click on this cancel button at the top top left x button so allow then also go to the top you see this place the road auto you want to switch it on so you come screw screw because you are on your settings now you screw then you click on this auto responder and click on allow access and allow it's very important that is when you'll be able to so now this button this plus button that is blinking at the top, bottom here you want to click on it then the next thing you want to do is click on use free so do you just take all this off so the first thing you want to do now you want to set a message that's uh, when they come with this message this is what will be in your wire link so when they come with this message into your dm your autoresponder will be triggered automatically so for example say the message you want them to come with from your wire link is i coach kelvin i am interested i am interested in learning how to make money online with my smartphone and data connection so this is the message you want them to come in with so you want to put in the reply you want to get from them so i would like to put this on random put it on random if you're interested then now this is the reply i want to give them i want to say you uh, welcome come on kindly save my my contact my contact as coach kelvin and type done when you are through with that so this is the reply I want to give them on my autoresponder. But one thing I also want you to do is this. You don't just type and leave that. You just leave it that way. One thing I want you to do is also go to, you scroll down and go to delay in seconds and add like a four seconds delay. Now what this does is that um, when somebody send you a message it doesn't just come automatically because these are the part of the things that um, the whatsapp uh, what's it called the whatsapp algorithm detects and they will end up blocking you because they see you as a spam or probably your message is like a spam to them or they detect that you are using um what's it called auto responder or a third party app for responding to people so they will definitely ban your account so when you put uh what's it called when you put a delay uh -huh, because they know definitely like a normal human being cannot just send immediately somebody send this and you are sending this immediately it doesn't make sense but when you are delaying for some seconds it shows that okay this is not a human uh, a, a robot that is responding is a human being 
So that's part of the reasons why you want to delay some to some seconds. You can do five, you can do six, you can do seven, ten seconds. It all depends on you, but let's leave it at four for the sake of this training. So you want to now click the button, the flash button there that was blinking. And um, this way up here, you can now press on the cancel button there. So what we want to do, we want to test this response and see. So let me copy the message I want them to bring in to me when they come in. So let's test this to see um, if this is going to be working or is going to be active. So what you want to do is this. First, you see this eye icon there at the top where the message and there is a hi, this one here. So you want to click on it. Then you want to go and drop the message that you have created for them to send and your autoresponder will trigger a response. So I want to paste this the way it is there and send it here and wait one, two, three, four. You can see four seconds you've gotten the reply so you can see the reply now you are welcome kindly save my contact as coach kelvin and type down when you are true so this is how the autoresponder works this is how to set up your autoresponder so you can continue to set up the reply for example when the person sent the when the person get this and they type down then you drop the response after the person type down probably you can now put your link and say okay you are you congratulations here is the link to join the group and all that and all that it all depends on how you want to set up your own autoresponder so it's left to you to do that but there's something that i really want to show you teach you so that you don't end up falling victim to this uh, whatsapp ban that has been uh, happening for a very long time now that's the recent thing that is really going on right now whatsapp is really banning accounts like crazy these days so one thing you want to do is uh what i will advise you you want to create multiple kind of response if you are going to be doing one response take for example you have like 150 leads 50 leads 100 leads 200 leads coming to your dm your whatsapp dm daily while you're running ads or while you're running influencer ad or paid ad or tiktok ad or whatsapp tv whatever and you're just going to be using just this one response you might likely get banned by whatsapp so this is a bonus information i'm giving you right now on this so what do you want to do you want to create like four five to six seven if possible ten different response you want your autoresponder to send randomly to these people. So it's difficult for the algorithm to detect, the WhatsApp um, algorithm to detect that um, this is a, um, a machine or this is an autoresponder that is responding to these people, not a human being. So what do you want to do? You want to create multiple response and you want to place it on, like we place it on random here, multiple replies, random. So it's not like all, it's random. So the autoresponder automatically picks anyone that it is interested in to use and automatically just send. You understand? So what do you want to do? You want to go to this plus sign, this plus. You want to click on it. You will see one line. You see, should be sent. Click on it again. Should be sent. Click on it again. So depending on the amount of response you want to put. So for example, you want to use four different kinds of response. You want to say, kindly introduce, introduce yourself. Or kindly, let's say kindly tell me your me so that I can save your contact you too can also save mine as push Kelvin to get 
they lead to my free training or so so let me type another one again it's nice to have me here I always love to follow up on my on my prospects. Let me use that word pros prospects to I'm just using a random word, please. So I'm not saying you should use this word. Be careful so that you don't go and copy me and you end up saying all sorts of rubbish. But this is just a random word. So it's a, it's nice having you here. I always follow up on my prospect to monitor their success closely. To monitor their growth, let me say growth, growth closely. Stop. So kindly save my contact as coach Kelvin, comma I have. Okay, or what can I save yours? is a question so please i'm just doing something random don't copy me just think of something by yourself to write then let me say another one is um thank you for reaching out to me kindly save my contact as coach Kelvin, what's your name? Question. So these are random, different random, uh, what's it called? Messages that the autoresponder can pick and send to them. So let's see if this will work. So you, when you are done with this, you want to click on that flash sign there, this one. Okay, so you cancel this, then go to that eye icon again where we use it to test it. Then uh, paste the message you want to be triggered. And let's see if it's going to send something different from the first one. Okay, so you can see. Kindly tell me your name so that I can save your contact. You too can also save my contact as Coach Kelvin to get the free. So you can see that the message that we got from the first time we did this is different from this one. So it's good you always do this so that it will help you to escape. Likely, let me not use the words like a guarantee, but at least to a great extent, this will help you escape um, WhatsApp ban because majorly the WhatsApp ban comes because the... Uh, WhatsApp system or the algorithm is detecting that you are sending the same message to multiple people, one same message to multiple people, and that is why you are getting that ban. So um, I think this definitely helps. If this helps, then great. But if you have questions, feel free to ask questions. So this is how to set up your WhatsApp auto responder.